Hey guys and welcome back to my YouTube channel or welcome if you're new here. So for today's video, I'm going to share with you guys how I edit my Instagram photos. So, marami nagtatanong sa akin kung paano ako nag-edit ng pictures ko. So if you guys know me, alam niyo sobrang hindi ko mag-take ng pictures and I also love editing them. So, ayun. So doing these kinds of things makes me so happy and I just want to share with you guys how I do it myself. If you guys don't know, here's my current Instagram feed. Ayan. And so I decided to make my feed um, more of cool and warm tones. Kasi sobrang ganda ng contrast nila. So yung feed ko rin, marami na rin siya pinagdaanan. So I'll just insert some of my old feed. Ayan. Ayan. So if you guys wanted to see how I edit my pictures, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. And also don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more videos like this. And I will stop rambling na and just get on with the video. So whenever I edit my photos, I only use three apps. So the first app that I use is Adobe Lightroom CC. So I love using this app to color correct my photos. And what I love about this app is that you can adjust the color depending on what you want. I select my photo. I go on with the color. And then mix. And I choose the blue beside the purple. And I make sure that the U is at negative 100. As well as the saturation. Because I love unsaturated photos. And I make sure that my luminance is at positive 100. And after with the blue, I move on with the greens. And I do the same thing. And after doing so, you'll find three dots at the upper right corner of your screen. So just click that, click copy settings, and then OK. And then I move on with my next photo, click again the three dots above, and then paste settings. And that way you'll be able to paste your edits much easier. And that's what I do for Lightroom. So now let's move on to the next app. So the next app that I use is Visco, Viesco, I don't know. But I use this app to make sure that I have filters on all of my photos. Um, I think that adding filters to your photos make them more put together. Especially when your photos kind of differ from one another. So here the first thing that I did was I added the photos that I just saved. And just like what I did previously on Lightroom, I just copied my previous edits and just pasted it on my new photos to make it a lot easier. But don't worry because I'll show you guys the settings later on. So I don't use any paid filters for any of my edits. So yep. And now I'm going to select my photo click settings and the filter that I use is KK2 because I love the tannish vibe and the reddish tone that gives to my photos and I have it on for about 6 and moving on with the grain I adjusted the grain to about 5 and that's basically what I do here in ViscoCam and I just make sure that I saved my photos So the last app that I use is Unum or Unum, I'm not quite sure, but this app helps me to see and visualize what my Instagram would look like. And what I love about this app is that it has a feature in which you're able to rearrange the photos however you like it. And guys, quick tip, I love adding plain background codes to my Instagram feed because I like separating two busy pictures from one another and I think by doing that my Instagram game changed. So I really love this app because I'm able to freely rearrange my photos and another preference is that I love alternating my photos. So for example, I have a bluish one. So the next one would be something warm. And even just by doing that little thing, I think that my Instagram looks more put together. And so yeah, that's how I edit my photos. So 
that's it for today's video. So I really hope you guys liked this video. And if you did, don't forget to give this one a thumbs up. And also don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more videos like this. And if you have any video ideas, just leave them down below. And I'm really willing to make them. I really hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you on my next one. Bye!